Jesse. This is the Jesse OBS YouTube channel. It's early in the morning right now, and we are on a one-way ticket to D-Town right now to pick up a Texas Speed 228R cam. This is the cam shot that's gonna go into our 1,000 capable motor. Right now, we're on the road. Check this out. Driving, you know. I haven't really recorded a video of me buying anything in a while, but uh, if you've been here for a while, you know that what I do when I buy something is I kind of just uh, record me going on the way or whatever, but when I get there, I put the GoPro in my pocket and then you just listen to the sound or whatever to respect their privacy. Yeah, I guess uh, when we get there, I'll pick it back up. It's a badass cam, good ass cam, so we'll see. So you see that's a 228 or 228 yeah. yeah. Okay. Um, like I said, there's nothing wrong with it. We uh, changed the cams and this is actually on my sister's car. We okay. just put a MS4 in her Camaro. Okay. So we just, we just put a bigger cam in that. There you go. All right. All right. Thank Have you. a blessed day. Thank you. You know, I'm yeah, forgetting the dust. Oh, boy. Let me show y'all what we just got. It's badass. This is crazy. Is this LT slash LSLT? Yeah, it's just LS slash LT. I was looking at it to see if any of the lows were scored. Yeah, nothing. Not, no, this thing's nice. Yeah, Let's right. see. 4,000 miles, you said? That's a new Cadillac front end on that hoe. Oh, nice. shit. That's badass. It's a new Cadillac. On the Avalanche. Oh, that's the new, new one. That's the new, new front end on that. Damn, these are working already. Ooh, this thing is beautiful. It feels good too. There's no scores at all. Yeah. It's smooth. Fuck, that's gonna be nice. That's gonna be nice. Mm -hmm. You should call David. I'm about to. I'm about to call David. Should have brought David, Loki. Yeah. Look at that. Woo! This is a uh, 228R six speed camshaft. Uh, if y'all, once again, been here for a while, the video on the Tahoe, which I'm pretty sure a lot of those people are watching oh, this video. Yeah. But the video on the toe, we were talking about a truck called Heartbreaker. In Heartbreaker, we had her whole spec list with receipts and everything in the glove box. So we knew that she had this um, uh, 228R camshaft, this exact one. And I knew that if I was ever going to build an LS, it was going to be with that cam because that bitch was ferocious. <laughs> that thing was an animal. And what did they have? All they had was a cam or All It was just uh, NA. It was NA. Just the cam. Just the cam. Cam. Tune, intake, stall, heads. Yeah. It was, a, it was a build NA. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. I know. But this cam right here, that bitch is going to be rowdy. Thousand or not, it's going to be rowdy. Look, in the box, man. In the box. Can't wait for this to go in, man. Damn. The reason the upload's been slowing down and the reason why we were even able to buy this right is because we've been working like dogs. dogs, man. Like dogs trying to trying to get everything done, you know, try to save a little money and do, to do what we gotta do. Since this whole coronavirus thing, you couldn't even buy one of these. They were out of stock, so we were lucky to find this one right here. I mean, it's all working out though, it's all working out. But um, I guess when we get back home, that's what we're working with. Yeah, catch you later. I come to y'all bearing bad news. So I'm sitting here with the beautiful 228R from Texas Speed, right? Our new baby that we just pulled up, that's gonna go into our Gen 4 right here. We were about to mock up the cam when Jenner, right here, that I have this little steel wool thing in, we were about to mock up the cam, slip it in, and I or install, really, install or mock up the cam when Junior luckily had the best idea in the world to just look at the cam bearings and see what they look like. The one's on the back. And to our surprise, so pick it up. Uh, can you see it? Yeah, yeah you, you can, can see that. Cam bearing number five, right? Yeah, I believe. Number five is scourge, nicked, bang, whatever you want to call it, right there next to the little oil hole. I don't know when it happened, how it happened or anything, but it's definitely messed up. But we were touching the lobes of this camshaft and every single square centimeter of this camshaft is smooth in it, like a baby's bottom. I mean, it sucks, but it's not that bad. You know what I'm saying? We already checked the rest of the cam bearings, took a look at them, and they're all fine. They're perfect. And they're all, they even installed properly. We made sure that, they're, that the holes were in the little oil holes. So the guy who installed them did a good job. Is some At some point on our end, uh, that got nicked. So no hay de otra but to just go ahead and take out this cam bearing and install with a new one. Take a look down that channel. All of them are good, man. There it is. All of them are good, except for the last one. Except for the last one. I'm obviously not gonna bore y'all with that because even that bums me out. Minor setback, sucks, but it doesn't matter. We're gonna keep going forward. We have the cam. Thankful for that, just thought I would share that with y'all. So. That's that.
So we got this prep. Took us like an hour to pull out this engine. It's almost out. Watch this one tire fire. And that, holy. Ooh, this got some nuts, bro. Really nothing. It's good. Yeah, check it out more. Hey. <laughs> Yeah, jump on it. Oh, 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 not the snap on, bro. Okay, okay. Oh. Oh. Mm, I'm gonna fuck. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> now go back. Now send it, basically. Just send it. Yeah, just send it, yeah. That's how you pull out an LS. There is no other way. 